I've been out and about in my motherly wisdom to try and find out how useful computer technology is for children. As far as they were concerned, it was no use at all, but it was loads and loads of fun. Ah, children, aren't they lovely? Sweet, cute, funny little tykes. They hold the promise of youth and adventure, innocence and insight. But if you're a parent like me, you'll know that it's not all sweetness and light because even though you can feel joy and amusement, you also can feel anger and exhaustion. And then there's the worry. Are they safe? Are they eating properly? Am I giving them the best possible experiences for the best possible future? Well, technology is going to be more important to their future than it is for us. Now, we've come to the Springhouse Nursery in North London to find out what parents and their children think of electronic education. Other one? You can't hear it. So has he used a computer before? Um, not really, only when he comes to my work and he just sort of plays with the mouse and types things in, but he hasn't actually got a computer. No. What's he doing? Now lead him to that. So he understands the uses of the computer and he's played, he's seen me playing on games, so he'll come and sit with me for a short while and get into the adventure. I mean, he's got to get into it. Yeah, like I agree, yeah, exactly. I was a bit uh, sceptical. It was only about a year ago that I've actually learned anything about computers myself. Right. You think he's home? I'm going to see if there's a hand on the line. Oh, we don't actually have any children programs or anything like that for the computers at home. But if I'm on the computer at home, she likes to sit on my lap and, you know, try and experiment with the mouse. But there he is, look good. What do you like about computers? Um, Abby Boo. Abby Boo. What do you do on Abby Boo? Um, you paint yeah. and you draw. Do you like drawing on the computer or drawing on paper? I'm drawing on paper as well. You like them both? Which one do you like more? Um, lion. You like a lion? Me. You just like a lion? Me as well. <laughs> It's nice to know his drawings are the same um, on paper and on the computer. <laughs> computer manufacturers would have us believe that using a mouse is child's play, but children are actually a bit uncoordinated, so a lot of software on the market is aimed at getting them used to the idea of moving images on the screen. But what I want to know is, is it good for their minds? It's very difficult for parents to get independent advice about the, the worthiness of computer software. Most of the advice comes from those who make it and those who sell it, and there really isn't any organization yet which has become prominent for parents to turn to. Some of the things you've brought in here today I hadn't seen before. Mm. So it's a matter of what you find out about word of mouth from other friends you've got it. Hey, yo. Do you want to put it back in the story? Not just yet. Can't do you think it's important for kids to use computers at this age? I do. I think the earlier the better. He's at an age now where he's gradually starting to construct and, and understand organisation of things. So I think, yeah, from that point, I think it's an ideal time. You know, I think it's important to get a child, you know, to learn how to use a computer and to, you know, develop their child's IT skills. However, I wouldn't encourage a child to, like, sit on it all day. I'm just cautious of it because it's, a, it's another piece of information which we don't really understand because it's so new and yet we're plugging them in Somebody fairly young. Uh, computers do require a child's full attention at the expense of looking and dealing with other things. Parents have to understand that is what they're doing when they switch on software for their children. Provided they do it very judiciously, it could be a wonderful supplement and a tool which helps their children when they're much older. If they get it wrong in the way that too much television or too much junk food uh, can wreak havoc with children, software can do the same. By the time my son reaches school, I'd like to think that technology is a positive force in his life. Places like the Springhouse Nursery School realize that computers are a fact of life, but they also realize that they're just one part of a well-rounded 21st century childhood.